Hi pals, today we're going to explore how maps can trick us when it comes to shape and size of the world. This is planet Earth. This is our world. And this is a map. The map of the world. Maps can make things look different and sometimes way different. It's all about how maps are designed. What they show and what they don't show. So first, let's look at Antarctica. See how huge it looks? Reality, it's much smaller. Imagine this, if you took a balloon and tried to flatten it out, some parts would get stretched out more than others. That's exactly what happens with maps. The further away you get from the middle of the map where the equator is, the more everything gets stretched out and warped. Just like how we saw with this map and how Antarctica is looking a lot larger than it really is. There's other examples too. Let's take a look at the continent of Africa and the country of Greenland. On this map, Greenland almost looks as big as Africa, right? But on the globe, it's tiny in comparison. That's because when we flattened out the globe, everything near the poles got stretched out, just like Antarctica. There are many different types of map projections. Because there's no way to flatten a ball without changing the visual distance and shape. So next time you look at a map, remember. The world isn't always what it seems. Shapes and space can be tricky. So think carefully about what you're seeing. There's a lot more to the world than meets the eye. To learn more about the environment, check out Planet Pals Learning. Thank you.